Alexander Zaitsev of the Soviet Union. After winning the gold medal in the Winter Olympics at Lake Placid, her third, they had announced that they would come here and try to win one more world championship, which would have been her 11th, and then retire. Well, as it turned out, they weren't to get that opportunity because she suffered a slight shoulder injury in training, and they were unable to compete here. Earlier this week, though, I did talk with them. Now, in the interest of time, we have edited out the translation of my questions into Russian. You will hear the interpreter translating the answers. Irina, what was the nature of the injury that prevented you from com competing here? Exactly what is hurt and how did it happen? Yeah, well, Irina says that she had uh, an injury on the 29th of um, February. It was cartilage in the shoulder. Were you doing a lift at the time? Did you fall? <laughs> yes, she fell from the lift. But you will be skating in the future. What What are your plans, Alexander? Um, right now, we're trying to prepare for the exhibition, which will take place here in Dortmund, and then probably take part in the tour, um, the ISU tour, in the countries of Europe. Some people don't understand why you can skate in an exhibition if you can't skate in competition. Could you explain it? First of all, the exhibition performances start a week later. Well, the first reason is that um, exhibition takes place a week later. That gives us time for the shoulder to cure better. This is the first reason. And the second is that we will be showing a program which is um, easier, which hasn't got the difficult element affecting the shoulder. So, Irina, after the 10 World Championships, three Olympic gold medals, no longer will you stand on the highest podium there. Does that make you feel a little sad? Or how do you feel? Oh, well, ev every athlete knows that time will come when he will have to finish his sporting career. And um, same thing with me. For 10 years I've been somewhat preparing myself for this day. But considering my victory at the Olympic Games, this big victory, I can't say that I'm very sorry that I'm leaving sports. When they played your anthem at Lake Placid, though, we had a very tight close-up. We saw the tear come down your face. Can you tell us what you were thinking then, or is it too private? Um, it's uh, a difficult question to give a short answer. Probably there were tears because they remembered the difficult days and the worries and probably the whole life which we lived in sports. Because we could um, come back and compete in such a short time and what we were hoping for and aspiring for came true. Boshoya Spasibo for everything, everything through the years and all the best of luck to you. Thank you. Irina Rodnina. To match her record, someone would have to win every world championship during the entire 1980s. It doesn't seem like it.